All right, we are on Indian Rocks at the public beach access uh, restroom area. Got my camera back under the building first. We have a double Y here, probably for the men's in the uh, the women's room. All right, so the second double Y. There's definitely something in the pipe that looks like it should not be there. Go to the end of this. So a lot of calcium buildup in here. That's usually from uh, urinals. A whole lot of calcium buildup here. So that's absolutely restricting the line. And it's causing it to hold a little bit of water. So lots of toilets in here. Got some toilet paper just hanging out back here. Big pile of toilet paper. A lot of debris. That's from it backing up. So when it backs up, it's going to back up all the way to the back, obviously. I'm going to see if I can get inside and at least flush these uh, back toilets to get some of that stuff kind of pushed through the line. Lots of sludge. I'll do a few more flushes.
under the building we got some calcium buildup and I can see now that past the clean out I'm in is backed up as well so we are completely underwater so we'll run the camera the opposite direction and see if we can figure out what's causing the backup past this clean out so now let's run out blockage right there right at 47 feet I can't push past it with the camera so let me see if I've got a blow bag or something in the truck all right so I just went back through the clean out I was able to get the, uh, the stoppage pushed down so we got a second clean out in here, probably underwater when we pass that guy. Oh, we're holding some more water already. Back of that 48 foot mark. So it's just, it looks like it's just a bunch of. Oh, I see. So we've got a lot of buildup right here. That looks almost like right where the pipe is going into main line of some sort. Just a lot of debris on that one corner there before it hits the plastic and then it's flowing fine. So the snake is just pushing a little hole through it right there and that's what's causing the backup all right so we're gonna work on getting all of that stuff out of there so that the line should flow a lot better so I'm gonna pull the, uh, the camera back see if I can't get that big chunk of stuff taken off of there because I believe that's what's causing this whole thing to hold water So I'm going to pause the video while I uh, while I work on it. Alright, so we worked this spot. I actually had to work it pretty hard. Um, but I was able to get all that debris removed from the side. It was just all piling up right there on that one corner. So, almost looks like we're in a manhole. Uh, but all of it's gone. Uh, there's people here just constantly uh, running water. See if I can get back up here so you can kind of see the flow. Absolutely looks like we're inside of a manhole. But everything now is uh, is flowing through that spot. It was hung up in there real good. I actually had to use a, a warthog head to get it all out of there. So 
So the line's flowing good. You're going to see some water in it because I've got um, people that just keep using these restrooms. Uh, but we'll pull back through the water. Hopefully I can keep the camera out of the water enough so that you can see that the pipe is clear. Everything's flowing good now. It's shouldn't have any more problems with, uh, with backups. Tiny piece of debris there. Just want to make sure there is no issues with the pipe. So we're coming back up towards the clean out now. All right, so I went back into the building and I pulled out what looks like a plastic, it's almost like a, maybe a bathing suit, maxi pad or something, and an, another one, pretty big chunk. So everything's flowing good now. Uh, everything's working. Should not give you any more problems. Gonna be dependent, obviously, on what gets flushed down the line. Thanks for watching.